Hello everyone, welcome back for another very useful and informative video. In this video, I'll show you if you're having this type of problem on your Google Chrome, this site cannot be reached on your iPhone device. So if you're trying to browse anything on Google Chrome on your iPhone device, and you are having this type of issue on your iPhone device on Google, then here in this video, I'll show you how you can easily fix this problem if you're having this type of issue on your iPhone or iPad device. So now let's get started how you can fix this problem. So first of all here you will need to open setting on your iPhone or iPad device. And here you will need to scroll it below and here tap on screen time. And here scroll it below and here tap on content and privacy instructions. And here you will have return of this toggle form here. Then after that here you will need to go back. Then here you will need to again open settings, scroll it below, then here tap on general then tap on soft update and here make sure that you are using an updated version of iOS. If you don't have an updated version of iOS, then you'll have to update your iPhone device to the latest version. Then after that, check the problem fixed or not. If you are having this type of issue again and again, then here you'll have to, here you'll have to make sure the internet strong connectivity. Weak internet connectivity can be the reason of this problem. So here you'll have to make sure that you are using strong internet connection if you're using Wi-Fi, then you will have to turn off the Wi-Fi and here turn it on again. And if you're using mobile data, then you here you will need to turn off your mobile data and turn it again. And after that, check that the problem fixed or not. If you're having still this problem, then here move to the next solution. Open again setting. Then here scroll it below and here search for a Safari browser. So here you will have to search for a Safari browser. So here is Safari browser. You will need to tap on this. Then after that, you will see this type of interface here. You will need to scroll it below. And here you will have to search for clear history and website data. Here you will need to tap on this. Then here you will have to select all history. Then here tap on clear history. Then after that, here scroll it below and here tap on advanced. Then here tap on website data. And here you will have to make sure that the website data portion is empty from here. If here is any data, you will have to remove all those data. Then after that, here is the option of block all cookies. Make sure that this toggle should be disabled from here. Then after that, close this. Then here, you will have to force restart your iPhone device by tapping on the volume up button, then volume down. Then the press power button until Apple logo appears. Then after that, hopefully after all these settings, your problem will be fixed and you will be able to use Google Chrome on your iPhone or iPad device. So that's it from this video. Hopefully you like this video. If you like this video, then please subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon so that you can get my all upcoming videos. Thanks for watching this video.